So around five months ago, I posted a video where I explained the Immersive Portals mod, which allows for non-Euclidean geometry in Minecraft, and that's pretty cool. But since then, okay, since then, there's been a lot of updates. So I thought I'd make an updated 2021 version. So, you know, here, here's that. So I'll be splitting this video into different parts. I'll show you some of the stuff you can do with it, which is pretty cool. And then I'll show you how to install it and I'll eat some extra stuff, you know, I mean, yeah. So anyway, I want you to take a look at these houses, all right? I want you to get them through your head. So this one's pretty small, all right? Kind of like my people. And this one's pretty big. You ready? You take a look here. You got, you look, it's, you know, it's a small house. It's kind of normal. It looks fine, but, oh, uh, oh, uh, 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 what, what is this witchcraft? I, what? Uh, oh, okay, small. Okay, everything's fine. Okay. What the fuck? And then if you go in this one, what? What? My mind is blown. My mind is blown. So that's all well and good, right? So you got you got your weird ass houses over there. But you know what's even cooler? You know what's even cooler? Portal. And I'm, when I say portal, I don't mean portals. I mean the game portal. You can see my beautiful bandana and my beautiful hair and my just beautiful everything through these portals. Okay. But you 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 walk through and. Hello, hello, hello again. Uh, oh fuck, he's gone. I can't make the joke. What? 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 You see big tunnel or or oh, oh, it's a small tunnel. What? What? How? Who did this? Wilbur Sup meme. Who did this? The coders for this mod actually just did an incredible job. This is absolutely perfect. You ready for this? You ready for this? I'm gonna come out sideways. Nyom. What? What? The portal even adds gravity. What? That's so cool. Oh my god. It's incredible. This is gonna blow your mind. Okay, so I have two portals here. Okay, I have big portal. I have small portal. Okay, they are they are linked together. Okay, big portal, small portal. Don't mind this. This is Gerald. This is my friend. I live a modest life with friends. You know, I don't have many, but the the one that I do have will always be by my side. Listen, if you just install the mod, this part won't work. All right, you gotta watch till the end of the video to figure out how this bit works. All right, you gotta you gotta watch right till the end, every single second. I'm gonna walk through this small portal. Okay, and it's gonna be it's gonna be oh oh. Oh, okay. Wait a second. I'm two times as big! Gerald, look! Look how big I am! This is what I've always wanted. This is- this is what I strive to achieve. I can't even- I can't fit back through the portal. I- I go back- I don't know why there's a ladder. So I go- oh. Oh. Oh my god. Oh my god, I'm back normal size. What the frick? What the heck? I'm, oh my god, what is this? I'm the same size as Gerald! We can finally be real friends! Are you proud of me? Are you proud of me? So this is pretty nifty, I would say. So I've used this example in the other video. Cooperator did did this, but you know, with a real game engine, not Minecraft. As you can see, we have four. We have a four-room square. I remember shapes. And I enter the green room, right? I've got green. I got feet on the green. You see me? You see? You see me? And I walk over here. All right. Everything seems normal. Everything's that's green. This is yellow. I like green. I like yellow. I mean, I like blue as well. I, blue's pretty cool. And there's even a little fire here. Then that's pretty. That's pretty epic. And back to green. And that's pretty cool. Yet, yeah, wait a second. I only did three left turns. This never gets old. I could walk around here for so long. It's so trippy. So yeah, the things you can do with this mod are actually like insane. It's incre It's really incredible. There's a really easy way of doing it as well. There's a whole Wikipedia um, page, and it and it shows you how you can do all this different stuff. But the, I'll show you the easy way, and I will also link the wiki page if you want to do it more complicated. So you just build a you just build any size portal you want, you know, you build a portal, okay? We build another portal the same size. You have to use these special blocks, portal helpers. You light them and boom, put I mean you probably want to fill this up with something, but yeah. You light it, boom. What? And if you have the right mods installed, it will allow you to change your size like this as well. It's it's really really cool. Are you ready? Whoa. Whoa. Now what happened here? What is this? Look at that. I can I can place I can place blocks out there. Look at that. I'm reaching through the portal. All right, I go through. What the heck? What the heck, you know? What the heck? This is probably like the most um technologically advanced mod I've seen in Minecraft so far. This is actually incredible. Like the things you can do. Oh, I'm so small. Look at that. I mean, it's not loading in, but look at that. Look at the end! It's the end! You see the crystals? You see the crystals and shit? 
Now, and it won't actually spawn the Ender Dragon in until you jump down there, so it won't like lag and like have the End Fighter running as soon as you light the portal. So now I'm going to show you how you can install them on. It's really easy and quick to set up. First off, this mod is a fabric mod, so you'll you will need fabric. I'll leave the link to that in the description. So basically, when you're on the fabric site, all you want to do is you want to look at the top little bar here. You want to click Use, and you want to download the installer. Now, if you're on Windows, you want to download the EXE. I mean, you can download the uh, the jar. It will still work, but this one is for Windows. This one is for both Windows and anything else that can run Java files. If you're on a Mac or a Linux, I think it works on Linux, you can download the uh, the jar file and it will work. So for simplicity's sake, I'm going to download the jar file because uh, that works on everyone's. If you download it on Windows, it will be exactly the same. It's just, as it says here, the Windows uh, may give you a warning about the safety of it and you'll have to bypass that. So you make sure you have Java installed, you launch the jar file and you choose the Minecraft version. So you want the latest one. You basically want to leave everything else and you want to press install. And it's as simple as that. You don't need to touch that anymore. You have to let that do its thing. I've already done it, so I don't need to install. And next, you will want the Fabric API, which I do believe Immersive Portals requires. Fabric API is basically a mod that allows most other Fabric mods to run. I'll leave all of these links in the description. It will be the second download link. So you want to go to Files. You want to find the one that's for game version 1.16.4. Uh, both of these look available for 1.16.4. You want to choose the latest one. Next off, you'll want to download the Immersive Portals mod. Now, this is the main one. So you want to go to Files. You want to find the 1.16.4 version, the latest one, and you just want to download this one. Now, the last mod is the the, the mod which I can definitely pronounce, and it's and it's very it's very strange actually. It's kind of misleading. Um, if you don't look closely at the page, it is kind of misleading because you'll look at the different downloads and you'll see game version 1.17, and that doesn't that's that's not 1.16.4. So you'll scroll down, you'll look for the right version, but actually, if you do look at it, it does say it's still compatible with 1.16.4. So you'll want to download this latest version that's still compatible with your version of Minecraft. Now, if you're watching this in the future, the versions will obviously be different, but as of now, you download this file. Now, once you have all your files, you want to go into your mods folder. If you don't know how to get into your mods folder, it is it's very easy. You can do it from in the, inside the Fabric Launcher. If you press on mods, you can press on open mods folder and you can insert mods there. So it will open this folder. As you can see, there's already a lot of stuff in here, but uh, these are the mods that you will want to put in here. You'll want to put the Fabric API, you want to put the Immersive Portals, and you want to put Pekui. Um, I have Sodium in here as well. Now, Pekui, you don't have to download this mod, but um, if you want the, the scale change, if you want to be able to change sizes as you go through portals, this is the required mod. If you want to change your size manually, then there's commands for that. I'm so thick. I'm so thick right now. I'm, I am so thick. All right, we go this small, okay? We do this. Oh, shit. Okay, um, I've, I, I, <laughs> I appear to have mutilated myself. I am actually terrifying. This is incredible. Are you intimidated? So yeah, that pretty much sums it up. It's a pretty cool mod. I enjoy messing around with it. If you want to subscribe, that would help out a huge bunch. I'm trying to get to 300 subs now. But yeah, that's about it. Thanks for watching. Uh, I'll catch you later.